Howdy viewers, Brad Proprietor, Barstool Entertainment, doing another Red Dead Redemption 2 video. Now, if you're first time here, please subscribe because I put out a lot of good videos. If you're returning, thank you. If you haven't subscribed, please do so. If you have already subscribed, well, thank you. I do put out a lot of good content. In this case, I'm going to show you some locations of trinkets. One of them is on an island, and when you swim with your horse, you want to boost its stamina up. Now, this island I'm going to is the location of the trinket. You can do some hunting here as well, but I'm going to cut to the location of the trinket. Now, this location of the trinket is on the opposite side of the island. More than likely, you're going to land on when you beat your horse. And there's a lockbox here. When you open the lockbox, there is a trinket. And that trinket is a cat eye trinket. And the trinket itself is actually pretty good. If you look at it, and, well, I'll show you on the map. It's on this island right here. And then when you actually look at the trinket, it permanently increases the duration of fortifying tonic effects by 20%. That is actually a pretty good thing. And this is really a nice trinket to have. And all you have to do is swim out to this island. And you can do some hunting as well. The island is further, I want to say, south of the island where you can hunt iguanas. Again, you want to fortify your horse's stamina when you swim out. Now, the next location is really in a cold area. Now, this trinket can be a little tricky. You got to kind of get John's stamina up. Getting to it is easier than getting away from it because, yeah, as soon as John hits the water, hypothermia sets in, no matter how well he is uh, bundled up. And so, yeah, you want to get some candy, you want to get the core stamina back up, you want to take a stamina tonic, potentially. Yeah, like I said, John gets hypothermia as soon as he hits the water. His stamina just drops to nothing. And now that I've got his stamina back up, let's take a look at this trinket here. And I'll show you on the map the location. You're way up here, Dead Boot Creek. You have to follow it all the way up. You're in the north above Lake uh, Isabella or whatever the, the big lake is. And this trinket is right here in this lockbox. And once you investigate, you loot the lockbox, and the trinket is the Hawk Talon trinket. Now, the Hawk Talon Trinket permanently decreases the speed at which stamina bar drains when drawing a bowl by 30%. Hey, that is really awesome if you use the bowl a lot. Now, the problem is leaving this area, and like I said, John gets hypothermia real quick. As soon as his body hits the water, yeah, you're pretty much dead, and... It's not a good thing. So I'm going to show you the struggle and let you look and make your decision for yourself if this is worth getting. As soon as his body hits the water, no matter how well bundled up he is, yeah, you're hitting hypothermia. Not only does it rip your stamina away real quick, it uh, starts to reduce your health very quickly. 
I'm boosting up John's stamina, eating up some candy bars and candy, and let's give it a shot again. Yeah, that brief swim in the cold water almost killed John. So I'm going to get him boosted up here. You might want to, before you get this trinket, get yourself a lot of candy and candy bars, stuff that will boost your stamina and some stamina potions. Yeah, that's what you need to do. And if you like this video, what you need to do is hit the thumbs up icon. And what you really need to do is subscribe. Because I post four videos a week involving video games with some shorts and other content. And you don't want to miss out. So punch that subscribe button. Hit that bell icon. Stay informed. As always, thanks for watching. Thanks for subscribing. And thanks for stopping by.